CBS 6 Sky Tracker, sponsored by Baugh Auto Body. Welcome back, everybody. 523, look at this. An elderly couple in Tuscumbia, Alabama will tell you they're very lucky to be alive today because that huge pecan tree fell right on their home Tuesday. They were watching the rain roll in from their sunroom when a strong burst of wind knocked that big old tree over and right on top of them. It took more than an hour to rescue the couple. Good news is they're expected to be okay. And that is a big tree. And Carrie, we've been watching this storm for two days now. That's right. It started in the nation's heartland where it began producing severe weather and as it marched eastward it continued to do so. Primarily wind damage and also some tornadoes. Now our threat here into central Virginia out ahead of this system, it's primarily the wind, also heavy rainfall which is already occurring and there will be a small risk that we could get out Quick, a quick brief tornado, excuse me, trying to merge those two words together as the system tracks into central Virginia this morning. Now the individual rain cells, they're tracking to the north, but the overall line will be advancing eastward through the day today, and there is some very heavy rainfall embedded in this. So let's just do a quick view here. Into the green, that's where you're getting light but steady rain, into the yellow and orange shades, and yep, that angry red, that's where you're getting the downpours right now. A little bit of lightning just to the east of the Kerr Lake region, west of I-85. It's quiet on I-85 and 995 right now, but this is that heavy shower that just passed away from I-85. It's moving into the heart of Amelia County right now. Powhatan County in western Chesterfield County will be next. Just a few sprinkles in the metro forest right now. Most of the heavy rain is still off into the western Piedmont, Buckingham County, into Albemarle County, and that's where we still have the flooding threat. Flash flood watch in effect until noon. The wind advisory, they went ahead and let that expire early. It was in effect until 6 a.m., but let me show you here. These wind gusts are still up around 30 miles per hour at times coming in from the south to the southeast. Sustained winds running about 10 to 20 miles per hour. So it is going to be a windy day today regardless. Temperatures you can already see they are dropping behind the cold front. Can you tell? It's about 10 degrees cooler immediately behind that front. We're still on the warm side of the system and as long as we are we have that threat for those strong to severe thunderstorms. Worst window for us here in the metro I expect will be between 10 a.m. and 3 p.m. But we could get a few showers ahead of that. It's just that I expect the main line to reach us by 10 a.m. Here we are pausing just after 10 a.m. all along the I-95 corridor. May not look like much, but there could be some really strong wind gusts in here. Very heavy rainfall. This should intensify through your lunch break. I would not advise lunch break outdoors today. This is going to be a take your lunch inside kind of a day. As the kids are getting off the bus this afternoon, may still have some strong storms in the heart of central Virginia because the cold front won't be through yet. It'll just be gradually weakening through the afternoon and evening hours. Peninsulas, you'll be done by 11 p.m. tonight. I do want to take you in tighter here so you can see the metro time frame. Yes, we could get a few showers, but by 10 a.m., that's when I expect things to really get nasty here into the metro. Nasty through your lunch break with very heavy rainfall, probably some lightning and the potential for some of those strong wind gusts. Rainfall potential out of this. We're talking about a half of an inch to an inch into the eastern half of the state, an inch to two inches into the western half. A few showers possible tomorrow on the back side of this system, and then it is dry and cooler for the upcoming weekend. Looks like a great fall day come Sunday, Robin Reba. Oh, that's going to be nice. Just All right. Got to get through this I rain. Know, right? Thanks, Kerry. Okay, ladies, it is time to get your groceries.